these are not activities it doesn't quite uh, befit one to say that I am sending out love and compassion love and compassion are your own being if they are there then you don't have to do them yeah they are like the radiation of the Sun if the Sun is there then it will radiate and if the Sun is not there then it cannot send out radiation hmm? it is not something cultivated it is not something that you can plan and do yeah this is what I discussed with the monk and he told me okay you are alright with that you can't send to people if you don't feel it If it's like when you eat them my example was it's like when you eat an apple you know the apple but if you didn't try I can't explain very well what is the sensation of eat an apple and he told me okay you have to work in your love and compassion your own love and compassion but now when I listen to you I I remember what happens if I can't maybe it's really negativity I don't want to be negativity but it's the truth you know it's like what I can do if I don't feel that fe loving compassion of me, of myself, and I get tired to be alive? It is absolutely great. <laughs> okay. <laughs> see, I get tired. I don't want to yes, one wake has up. To, see, any sane person has to get tired of uh, <laughs> all this phony business. You are... <laughs> tired of just the yes, being right myself. things it's great that you are tired of them you see love is not a feeling and love is not a feeling and one gets tired of artificially forcibly trying to develop that feeling one gets tired of all the sham that goes on in the world. What does it mean, sham? Sham means uh, fakeness. Mm. Love is extremely subtle, very subtle. What you can feel is attraction, what you can feel is repulsion, mm. what you can feel is emotions. Love is not an emotion. Hmm? But if you are told that love is an emotion and you must feel it, then you will look for an emotion called love. That does not exist. What I learned, yeah, yeah. That does not exist. So even if you are loving, you will come to conclude that you lack in love and it will be a very depressing feeling. You know, you might already. Mm -hmm. be in a loving state but that loving state is not one of feeling or emotion somebody comes and he tries to teach you that you must feel love or that you don't have and it's great that you don't have that <laughs> so what do you earnestly conclude you conclude that love is lacking in your life and uh, that's a bad conclusion to have it makes you sick it makes you feel tired and it makes you search for love unnecessarily try considering this it is possible that you are already all right it is possible that being already all right means that you lack in neither love nor compassion it is possible that love and compassion are not loud statements to make it is possible that love and compassion are not about going out there and helping him as per one's own standards. Hmm? Simple abidance in one's relaxed self can be a great exhibition of love. One doesn't have to do something with others to display love. Right? Sometimes non-interference is great love. Sometimes knowing one's mind 
is great compassion for the world and many a times those who try to display love are actually very violent people mm-hmm. and an attempt at being compassionate is often a proof of the violence hidden within the really loving man the really loving mind has no need to display love because it's every single movement is love its word is love its eye blinks in love its heart beats in love it breathes love it walks love so how will it ever display love love is not something that you can do or display mm. right your own being if it is surrendered to the truth is love what happens if i don't feel that love love is not a feeling you cannot ever feel it but if i am not consciousness about that love what you say it's wonderful that you are not conscious about it because if you are conscious then you will think about it to be conscious about something means that you have reduced it to an object of thought and love is not something to be thought of you can think about this table you can think about the wall you can think about things love is not a thing hence love is not something that you mm. must grapple with or try to conceptualize or think about hmm? so if you don't feel love congratulations that's <laughs> exactly how it should be right hmm? your state of undisturbed relaxation in which thoughts feelings emotions none of them are powerful enough to unsettle you that is love do not just be dominated by the world do not be taken in by the images that they display of love mm. all the images that they display are images of thoughts emotions and feelings they say look at this woman she is in love and what kind of image would that be yeah or happiness all happiness excitement i don't feel yes love dripping from her face <laughs> hmm? that kind of an image <laughs> don't be taken in by that love is a very very silent thing i'm talking of real love mm. not uh, <clears throat> ostentatious love love is an extremely silent expression mm. 